Hi, my name's Ed Kosis, and I've been with Harvest Outreach for over 20 years. Uh, my main focus, as the Lord has led, is uh, Mexico missions, specifically to a, an orphanage in Tijuana where we work. Um, we go every other month. I, sometimes I go a little more often. Now, on the Mexico missions trips, we, we have opportunities to do, to do more than just work on the new building that we've been, uh, that we've been involved in. Um, we also do a lot of cleaning some painting. Occasionally we'll come down with a full uh, cooking staff and we'll make a, a big lunch for the kids. I really feel it, um, uh, us being down there makes a, a big impact to those children because they know that we're there serving Jesus Christ. The, the project I mentioned earlier is a two-story dormitory for the, uh, for the girls. It's uh, the girls' dormitory. It has beds for 36 people and Without that, they may be shutting down the orphanage because the buildings are so dilapidated. So it's up to the orphanage uh, to take care of the responsibilities that the government is putting on them. But this is where Harvest comes in because at that point, we supply uh, power, manpower, woman power to, uh, to go down there and do that work. And also a lot of funds. Uh, we've had people of all ages come down from uh, say 12 all the way up to 70 and they all enjoy it and they all, all have uh, great praise uh, for, for going down there. God has softened my heart so tremendously by just being able to serve those children and how they broke my heart just to see how, how sad it is to, to, for them to uh, just ma imagine being uh, an orphan in Mexico on the street. It's just horrible. So that's um, basically how uh, Mexico Missions and Outreach has helped me in my walk with the Lord and getting closer and drawing closer and nearer to the Lord and feeling His Holy Spirit in my life. And I, I believe that if any of you feel a call, or even if you don't feel a call and you just know you need to do something, come on along. Just come on a trip. It, it's, it, it, it's not a big deal. It's, you could do, like I said, one day. But I'm sure you would... Um, you would be encouraged and you would definitely have some growth in your life, even if you chose not to make it uh, something continuous. Thank you.